Today is the history of a man who explained why our sea is blue in color and he explained it using phenomenon of diffraction. He is Indian physicist who made groundbreaking works in the field of light scattering and the Bharat Ratna awardee Sir C. V. Raman. Chandrasekhar Venkatraman was born on 7th November 1888 in Tiruchi, Tamil Nadu to father Chandrasekhar Ramnathan Iyer who was a lecturer of mathematics and physics and mother Parvati Ammal. He married Lokasundari Ammal and they have two sons Venkatraman Radhakrishnan and Chandrasekhar. He completed MA from University of Madras in 1907. While studying in the university, Raman published two papers on diffraction of light and surface tension of liquids. Since at that time a scientific career did not appear to present the best possibilities, Raman joined the Indian Finance Department in 1907. Though the duties of his office took most of his time, Raman found opportunities for carrying on experimental research in the laboratory of the Indian Association for the Cultivation of Science at Kolkata, which is the first research institute in India, which allowed him to do independent research and where he made his major contributions in acoustics and optics. At the ISES, Raman did a groundbreaking experiment that eventually earned him the Nobel Prize in Physics on 28th Feb 1928. He, along with K. S. Krishnan, discovered the evidence of the quantum nature of light by observing the scattering of light, an effect that came to be known as the Raman effect. This day is celebrated as National Science Day in India. Raman used equipment worth merely 200 rupees to make discovery. The Raman effect is now examined with the help of equipment worth almost millions of rupees. The work he did with the scattering of light eventually led to the development of Raman spectroscopy. Raman was the first person to investigate the harmonic nature of the sound of Indian drums such as tabla and mridangam. In 1917, he was appointed as the first pilot professor of physics at University of Calcutta. He founded the Indian Journal of Physics in 1926. In 1947, independent India's new government appointed Sir C. V. Raman as the first national professor of India. He also made contributions to the field of human vision, the optics of collides, and electrical and magnetic anisotropy. On his first death anniversary, the Indian Postal Service published a commemorative stamp of Sir C. V. Raman with the reading of his spectroscopy and a diamond in the background. Sir C. V. Raman. left a massive impression in the world of physics the entire world owes to him follow us on facebook and instagram and subscribe us on youtube at ragashree video